This training module covers OWASP A2, Broken Authentication, and Session Management. This module is divided into five sections. Risk Profile, Example Attack Scenarios, Preventative Measures, Discovering Vulnerabilities, and Reporting Incidents. A broken authentication or session management vulnerability is where an attacker uses leaks or flaws in authentication or session management functions to gain credentials such as login credentials or session IDs in order to impersonate users. <clears throat> because authentication and session management schemes are often custom built by developers, this type of vulnerability is quite common. And since the impact of these flaws can be severe, care should be taken to ensure no applications are subject to any authentication or session management vulnerabilities. Take a minute to review all of the information on this slide. When you are finished, resume the video. Let's review a couple of attack scenario examples. In the first scenario, the session ID is put into the URL. When the user shares this link with their friends, for example, over social media, those friends will have access to the user's session and all related information, including any credit card info that, that, that this site may contain. In the second scenario, the user accesses a site on a public computer and then leaves by only closing the tab rather than logging out first. The next person to use that computer would be able to access the first user's session. Pause the training video here to review these examples if needed. There are two primary ways to prevent broken authentication and session management vulnerabilities. One, using a single set of strong authentication and user management controls, ideally accompanied by a simple interface for developers. And second, make a strong effort to avoid cross-site scripting flaws. For more information on cross-site scripting flaws, see the A3 cross-site scripting training. To detect authentication and session management vulnerabilities, ask yourself and your team if the issues listed on this slide are occurring. Take a moment to pause the video and review this list. In sum, we care with how login credentials and session IDs are handled in transit, at rest, and how they're accessed slash viewed. This concludes the OWASP A2 Broken Authentication and Session Management Training Module. More information can be found at the links listed on this slide. Materials for this module have been derived and adapted from OWASP under the Creative Commons Attribution Sharealike License, which can be viewed at the link listed on this slide.